Hey guys, I have a cool video for you today. It's like I'm Conan O'Brien or something. I like, um, what do you call, uh, hey, we have a great episode for you today. <laughs> but it's, um, it, it's a 2x2 two two torch key or dust trap door or whatever. And what makes it funny is that each individual unit the for the 1x1 one one, uh, trap door, it is 3 by 5 by 3, which is the exact same as the one I did the month earlier, 3 by 3 by 5. So it's pretty much the same thing, except for the fact that this one, if you wanted to have blocks on all sides, you would have to redirect the redstone over here. And this one, you don't have to change anything, so already it's superior. And this can actually be turned into the 2 by 2, uh, as shown, but this cannot because, like, earlier the dust is interfering so I'm going to show you how to build one unit and at the end I'll show you how to put them all together so just build your jab door sort of thing over here and I'm going to go on this side and put a piston on the block that when this one is going to be extended it'll be powered piston on that block and a block on there and you're going to need to make a weird L shape sort of thing with the corner cut out and put torches on all of them and then over the gap where there isn't a torch put a block there on uh, on a piston or a piston on the block whatever and then have a sticky piston there leave the redstone block off there's going to be a redstone block that goes there eventually but leave that off for now otherwise when you put it in a two by two it'll create a clock so if you're making anything larger than a one by one do not put a redstone block there and this design does not work on Bucket, sadly. However, my friend Fennelman is going to upload a video tomorrow on his, and his does work in Bucket. So, uh, right now you have this, and it actually extends, but it doesn't retract. Now, I will cut the video and be back with the 2x2. Two two. Alright, I assembled the 2x2, two two, and it actually looks pretty cool, I might say. This is one of the first times I've seen it with its top off, the other time was that time. But anyways, uh... I built everything except the redstone blocks. Now, once you have all of this done, you can place a redstone block under each sticky piston head that you left uh, empty earlier. So, redstone block there, redstone block there, redstone block there, and redstone block there. And then, um, it'll work. So, as soon as you do that, it does pretty badass stuff. And this is it for this video. Until next video, goodbye.